Hi everybody, Michelle here with Creative Operation and Country Craft Creation. I've got like this mega haul of stuff that I'm going to share with you. Um, some of the stuff I actually got at the store um, during the October Utah retreat that I went to. And so I'll share that. Some of this is my design team package stuff from Country Craft Creations and OMG, it is so cool. So I just wanted to share I'm going to try and make this quick because it is a lot to look at, but I just had to share with you some of the things. So I've got ideas like crazy and I got to tell you, this is just awesome. So there are three of the Country Craft Creations Christmas themes that I've gotten. Um, I got Snowman and Friends, I've got oh, Once Upon a Christmas, and I got Twas the Night, and I just think these are absolutely adorable. So I have the the two are 8x8 eight eight, and then I have one that's 12x12. And I have a really cool idea for this. Um, <laughs> but I'll real quick go through this. So this is Twas the Night. This is exclusive to Country Craft Creations. It just has some beautiful vintage images. I mean, seriously, they're just absolutely adorable. And, you know, just like all the packs, you get tags and you get cut aparts. Um, the cool thing about this is that they're, they're pages from the story. So the, Twas the Night Before Christmas, I mean, it's pages through the story. So I am going to create a really cool... Um, project with this. I'll just real quick go through this, but the pages are absolutely adorable and I, they're just, they're so pretty and you know, what a cool, what a cool paper collection this is. So, um, I have this, I'm, I'm so excited. I love, look at, the, look at the images. I mean, they're just gorgeous. So we have this, we're going to play with, which is the story. I love it. Chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf. I just, <laughs> I can't get over how cute this is. So um, I have this collection that I'm going to be using. This is available at Country Craft Creations at countrycraftcreations.com. And I've got a great little project that I'm coming up with this uh, or coming up with for this paper. And I just, I just, I'm, I'm just like in love. I just love it. So cute papers, really adorable. I love the vintage colors too. The real kind of muted browns and reds and everything. I just think it's really pretty. So that's the first um, Country Craft Creations paper that I have. And then this one here, OMG. I mean, I'm telling you what, if you guys are into like the prim stuff, this totally reminds me of the prim. This is called Snowman and Friends. Um, Country Craft Creations exclusive papers and let me share with you what you're going to get with this one. Super cute. So this one has the cut aparts here. Look at look at all the colors. So the blues and the yellows and everything. So it's traditional with the red and the green but then we've got the pop of the blues and the yellows and I just think that's absolutely adorable. And then you have the cut apart cards here and then border strips here and look look at the lettering. Believe, love, joy. I love that on the back here, um, and the snowmen. I love snowmen. They're like, they're like my favorite critters ever for the holiday season. So, um, I collect them and I just absolutely adore this paper. And look at the little birdies. Can you see the little birdies? Oh my God. They're so cute. I love these snowmen. So you guys, this is, um, beautiful, beautiful collection countrycraftcreations.com. Check it out. Snowman and friends. I just, when I saw this, I just about fell over. I just thought it was so cute. So I can't wait to play with this one. And look at the yellow. I mean, it just makes it pop. So this isn't necessarily Christmas. It can be winter theme. I mean, you can do it for both. I mean, it's just adorable. And this one has the holly with the, with the um, gingerbread man. Super, super, super cute. Love it. Love it. Love it. So, and the trees and the, oh, look at that little angel snowman. So sweet. I just love it. Okay. So I said that a lot. <laughs> okay. So that is Snowman and Friends. So I wanted to real quick go through that. Um, the other collection that I got for Christmas is Once Upon a Christmas. And this is a very beautiful, nostalgic um, winter theme. This is a 12 by 12. And again, exclusively from Country Craft Creations. So we have all the fun little cut aparts here which I absolutely adore. And I like the pop of purple. So this is Christmassy, but it has a little bit of um, untraditional kind of colors in it, which I think is really gorgeous. And I love that the train has some of that kind of magenta-y purple, burgundy kind of looking colors in there. So this is a full sheet of tags, which is awesome. And on the back, it's gorgeous, just gorgeous. And then we have our birds. I'm gonna do something different. These are bigger. They're harder to do 
like that. But look at the pretty bird. You could do a full page layout here. It's just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. And this whole winter scene with the barn and the house in the back, super beautiful with the flowers in the forefront. Just love that. I like the backs. They have a really nice, beautiful, you know, they're not solid color. I just, they're going to be great for background pictures. And if you cut them apart for tags and things, you don't have to cover the backs of them. That's the cool part. I love that they're double sided. And I love this too. Gorgeous. You could cut these apart and make tags out of that paper. You totally could. Um, there's this. I love the newspaper with the sleighs on the back. Our 1875 Portland Cutter, <laughs> which that's awesome. I wonder if it's Portland, Oregon or Portland, Maine or whatever. I don't know. I'll have to look that up and where that name came from. But isn't that cute? Look at this. And this one with the church in the back. And Merry Christmas with the oranges and the flower. Oh, And the little drawing of Santa Claus down here. Can you guys see this? This is gorgeous. I love this paper. So beautiful. The ornaments and the Santa Clauses. <laughs> so pretty. And the train. You guys. Oh, that is so pretty. That is so pretty. I love that. Beautiful, beautiful colors. So go through this. So I have those three Christmas play papers that I'm going to be playing with for the next two months. Um, so I'll be doing projects with those. Just gorgeous, gorgeous paper. And then, so let me tell you, um, my design team package. So my current design team package is this. I'm going to go through that in a minute, but I wanted to kind of go through all of this first. So I did, I went shopping, um, and this is like shopping on my own at Country Craft Creations. And so when I was in Utah, I did, um, some things. I, I, my credit card took an absolute hit when I was there because all the Tim Holtz stuff was out and I had to have that. So let me show you something here. So when I went to the store, and I'm not going to open these and go through them, but they're they're online, and all the Tim Holtz stuff was there. So all the little Christmas ephemera pieces, the collage tiles, this one's called. This one here, I got the ephemera pack, and it has all kinds of, look at the stuff on the back. I mean, that's what you get in that pack. And then I got, let's see, these are chipboard pieces here um, called baseboards, and all the pieces, look at the door. I mean, seriously, these can be incorporated in so many different projects. It's just not even funny. But I got all the things. <laughs> I got, I bought all the things. So I got the layers here. And on the back, look at all the different things that you get in here. I mean, these are absolutely stunning. Um, I got the icicles. I bought a, a, two packages of those. And they're acrylic. They're really nice. And then, let's we'll see, this is the paper I got, the backdrops. And... These papers are absolutely gorgeous. So I think I'm thinking, you know, I'm going to be making a really nice project. But this is kind of like I wanted to buy this, so I got all of these pieces. And this is a paper pack, and excuse me, it's called Worn Wallpaper Scraps, and it has some um, ephemera pieces as well as some paper pieces. So it has borders and poinsettias and all that stuff. So I bought this back when I was in Utah in October, and so then when I went online to go shopping, I bought some more things to go with it because some more things came out. So I did get the candy canes and the confection. So you have like the little um, peppermint drops and things in there. I got that. I got the droplets. So these are the flat back pearls that are all in Christmas colors. So there's like, looks like some pearl and some um, blues, greens and reds. So I picked that up. I had to have the tinsel. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with it, to be honest, but <laughs> I am going to figure it out because I had to have it. I just think it is so pretty. And this pack is huge. You get four yards. I mean, it's just crazy big. Um, I also picked up some more um, layers. This is called layers. And um, all of these poinsettia and flower pieces, some trees, um, some holly, some um, pine cones, all that stuff. So I just think that is gorgeous. So that's going to go with my stuff. I picked up some lights. These are very, very cool. Christmas lights, tiny lights. There were two in the package, so I picked those up. And then, because I really wanted these, and I know Halloween's over, but I had to have them, um, I bought these. So <laughs> that's not Christmas. That's not Christmas, but I did get all of this, you know, stuff. So it's really, really fun. So I'm going to have quite a lot to play with when I make my Tim Holtz stuff. Oh, I did get this, too. I got the um, linen tape, so I got the the red and the green plaid linen tape. So I'm going to be playing with that. Also, while I was in Utah, 
I picked up a bunch of the Prima Halloween stuff, and I really did think I was going to get to it um, during Halloween season, and I didn't. Um, I, I just flat ran out of time with all the other projects that I had going on. So when I was in Utah, I did pick all of these up, and I know some of you probably have these already and haven't used them, so we're going, I'm still going to use them because I love Halloween, and I love these colors, and I'm, st I'm still going to play with them. But I did get the journaling note cards um, from this, and this is the Luna Collection by Prima. I got the um, ephemera pack, and again, just super beautiful I, and the colors, I, at first, honestly, to be quite honest, I wasn't sure about the orange and the pink, but it really grew on me the more that I saw people using it. So I am going to make something with this. I just haven't had time to do it yet, but we're going to have kind of like a, uh, maybe either a late Halloween or an early for next year Halloween project. <laughs> so here's another pack of ephemera that I got. So there's two different um, packages. Let me see here. Um to show you that so super beautiful um, and you get two of each in each the, of this I got the say it in crystals there's 48 gems in this and I just thought I had to have that had to have flowers that go with it right had to have that so those are super pretty um, this pack also I got the paper collection and then I got the chipboard stickers so um, lots of things with that. So this is what I bought in Utah, but then when I did my order, I bought some more things to go with it. So I did pick up the glass charms that go with it. And you guys, these are so cute. They're little like ornaments with, you know, um, sequins in them. This one is stars. Well, they're all stars, but there's black and pink and orange and they're stars. They're so cute. So I picked those up because I really wanted to play with those and then I got some more flowers. So I picked up more flowers that go with it and then I picked up leaves because you have to have leaves with your flowers and I really loved the black ones. It is Halloween and so I really had to pick that up. And then I picked up the 12 by 12 paper pad too because you know you just have to have that. And the papers, I mean they're just, you can see, I didn't, I didn't even open this yet. Um, I just got it the other day. Um, the papers are gorgeous. So we're going to have either a late, um, for 22 or an early for 23 Halloween album, just because I want to do that. And I wanted to purchase that for myself. I also, while I was there, um, Tammy's been talking about these scissors and I do not have a pair of fussy cut scissors that are, you know, that great. So I decided to pick these up because she says they are the best scissors for detail cutting that um, you can get. So I'm, I'm going to be trying these out and um, I, I picked those up. So they are online as well. And then I also, because I wanted these, I saw these, I picked these up from the store and they're cutting dies. So this one does the mailbox and then this one has some um, different things that you can add to your mailbox. And so I picked those up and I loved that this one's had a Santa Claus thing on it because I think this might end up being maybe a couple um, Christmas cards. So we'll um, probably play with that online. I'll probably do a, a little look, see, show and tell kind of thing with that. And then I also, I'm in love with Polaroids. I love Polaroids. Um, so I went ahead and picked up this die set that makes this cute little Polaroid camera with a Polaroid picture. So I had to have that. So that was kind of my shopping spree that I wanted to share with you. And then last, but definitely not least, um, I did, this is my other part of my design team package. Okay, so I am going to be using uh, Cartabella's White Christmas. I love this paper collection. It is so cute. And I love Cartabella paper. It has the texture on it, so it feels really nice. And let's go through here real quick. I did buy these um, single, so I did buy two of each design so that I had them. But on the back of this one, it says, wishing you a Merry Christmas, Happy Holiday Season, greeting on the green here, and then the, the cute little cars with the trees on the top. I thought that was super pretty. All these little cute tags, and I have an idea already for what I would like to do with this. <laughs> so back is red with the little X's on it. We've got green plaid. Um... Pretty traditional colors for the most part with the reds and the greens, but then there is my beloved pop of blue. I love the blue. I love this ornament paper too, it's gorgeous. We have red stripes on the back. We have cut aparts. I really like that they do some cut aparts that are all different sizes. So had to have that. And again, when I 
when they have the cut apart sheets, I always buy two so I can use one for the cut aparts and then I have one sheet so I can use the background too. So um, this one is blue with like little black dots on it, which is really cute. But I love, I love that. It's very cute. We have blue plaid here with the, with the red in it. I think that's awesome. And then look at the little, the houses with the barns. And then we've got the little churches and stuff. Oh, isn't that adorable? I love it. And little, little bridges, super sweet paper. I just love this paper. Here's another one with the houses. I just think that is absolutely super cute. How, how am I going to be able to cut this apart? I'm not really sure. Same with Tammy's papers. With the Country Craft Creations exclusive papers. I don't know how I'm going to cut them. I really don't. Um, really cute. This is green with little little light green stars in it. Really cute. And the snowflakes. Gotta have snowflakes. So another cut apart sheet. And again, I bought two so that I could have one for just cut apart. And then I could have one so I could use this background image here. And this is really cute decorated trees. So I think that's really pretty. Um, Santa Claus here with mailboxes and trees and little reindeers. Super sweet. And the plaid again, presents. And then on the back of here is the green with little black X's in there, little cross stitches, I guess. Super sweet. And then the um, snowmen, my favorite. I love my snowmen. They're my, I just love snowmen. I love them. And then the snow scene back here. I think that's really great. And then the other thing I picked up with the paper collection is that I picked up two of each of the solid color cardstocks that coordinate with this. And these are again, White Christmas by Cartabella. And on the backs, you have these colors too. So I have one for each color and I can use those in my projects. So that's the paper collection. And then to go along with it, I picked up a few things. So I did pick up these cute sprinkles um they have little penguins in them and then little candies and little sprinkles so i'm gonna do something with a shaker and i have a couple ideas for that this is called happy feet um, i picked up green buttons and these are from country craft creations just super nice pack of coordinating green buttons so i'm going to be able to put that and add that into the collection i did get some red um, twine and I got some red and white seam binding to go with this and I thought the red twine would be really pretty incorporated with the green buttons um, I thought that would be nice enamel dots that match the collection um, I got the ephemera pack and this has 34 pieces and we have lots to choose from in this so that's going to be fun to incorporate into my pages I also picked up the adhesive brads I love these these are super sweet um you know, they call them adhesive brads because there are no brad tines on them. They have, um, um, what you call it, um, like foam dots underneath them. And I use a little bit of glue and use those. They look like brads, but you don't have to poke your paper, which is kind of sweet. They work really well to put on the ends of seam binding and things like that. So you can have like little dangles. They look great on the corners of pictures. And then this pack also has some chipboard pieces as well. So I, I really like that as well. I love this truck. <laughs> so cute. And then I did pick up the um, chipboard phrases, one pack of those. So I'll have all of these to play with as well. So... That is going to be like my design team package. And then for me, um, I bought the uh, poinsettia die from Heartfelt Creations through Country Craft Creations. So I'm going to be able to play with this and make some poinsettias. And I'm super excited to be able to do that. So I really like um, like this. So I'm going to be playing with this and incorporating them into my design team package. So Wow, that was a lot of stuff um, to go through. And thank you so much for watching. I hope you're excited as I am to be playing with all of this because I have a lot to play with for Christmas. So my design team package is White Christmas by Cartabella. And also for the next couple months, I will be playing with the next um, or these three country craft creations. Once upon a Christmas, we have Snowman and Friends and we have Twas the Night. So those are my design team packages. Um, the Prima Halloween papers Luna and the Tim Holtz Christmas papers are going to be side projects for me um, and because I just had to have them. So <laughs> you can see I've been doing a lot of a lot of shopping and stuff lately so I've got a lot of things to get go get ready. So I am going to um, stop this video. I'm going to start working on some tutorials and I'm going to be back soon. I hope you would 
um, you know, join me for my upcoming tutorials. And thanks so much for watching. Thank you very much for your support. And it is November. This is Gratitude Month. I am grateful for each and every one of you for all of your support, your kind words when you give me comments. Um, and thank you so very much for everything. I do appreciate it. Um, I'm having a blast being a design team member for Country Craft Creations. And I hope you are really enjoying everything that um, myself and all of my other fellow designers are doing. And also what Tamara's doing with her store and with all of the, the, the special you know things that, that are coming up. Um, do want to mention one thing, the Craftology box that I have been involved with um, a couple times is actually sadly coming to an end, um, but there are more things coming that we're going to replace that with. One is going to be kits in the store that everyone can um, you know, purchase without having to have a subscription. So as details emerge, I will let you know what those are. Um, but please visit Country Craft Creations at countrycraftcreations.com and check out the store and check out the blog because they will have some announcements i believe on there also if you are not a member of scrapbookers or country craft creations on facebook please check that out and um, become a member you will be notified of all the things that are going on all of the events all of the virtual retreats the in-person retreats all of the great contests all of the tutorials from all of us designers and um you know you'll just keep um you'll keep up on what's going on. So um, please check that out. And thank you so much again for watching. I'll see you soon with tutorials and, and other fun things. So stay crafty and have a great day. Bye-bye.